Hello good guys. Welcome back to my channel. Hope you are learning Django very well for by following my videos. In this video I will be creating views functions and you will learn how to map that views function with URL. Means we are going to create a URL and run same URL using the web browser. So here we are going to create a views. So let us go and understand what different views we have it. We have a different kind of views. We have a function based view. We have a class based view. So in this tutorials, we will see function based view. In the coming tutorials, you will also see how to create a class based view. So let's get started. So you have to open the, your existing project, which you have created using the previous videos. So guys, you can see here. So my project is here. So I have opened in the VS code. So you can go there to create. First of all, you need to create a view before creating a URL. So let's go and navigate to the project folder okay so you can see here i have a my django project one which is a root directory inside that you have another called the my django project one you know which is a main app of one of the app of the project django project so right click on this create a new files write views.py okay now open the views.py and very important package we need to you know the import is called the django.http and import from here is a http response because we are going to send simple http response we are not going to render any kind of html file in this video in next video we'll see how to render our actual html files okay if is a keyword because we are going to create a views function but based on the function based view so we are going to create a function based view so we are going to let suppose we are going to create about a simple exercise this is a functions colon and it returns http response this response may have a simple statement to be printed which is not complicated right we are it is about us so we are learning we are learning django you know we are learning django from kundan kundan kumi so we have created a uh, function here so one more uh, compulsory you know parameter we need to pass as a request okay so we save it fine we have saved this file now what we need to do we need to link map this function of view with url you know with url here so what we are going to actually we are going to rot url is also known as a rot so first job you know you can see here they are giving the instructions here how to examples how to you know include your views in this url files so first of all they're telling import your app and import your views okay so we can say app so we can go there right here from my app name is my project one that is my app see this is my app you can see in the left hand side my app what do you want to import from this app import what this file this file views file so i'm going to write here import views done guys once done here now we are second step say how to change the path you can see they are saying change the path so we are going to write here First of all, I path. It have a different parameter. You can see the first one is a rot. Rot means that URL that you want to create. So we give, give there. We can map the same. We can write a single quotation. We can write about us. This is the URL I'm posing, followed by slash. Now here, what is the next? Next, you have to give the views is your file here. Views is your views then inside you can say dot you can give them about us then save it so now what you have done this is a view you have a file here which is you have about us is a functions so we have we are going to link means we are going to call this function which is inside the view this function using the uh, which is inside the view about us using this url so what we have done when we access this url using the web browser this functions about us function of this view will be called invoked okay fine so save it now let me see i have already run the server already previously 
okay before starting the my video so is already running guys otherwise you know how to run the server you can go python space manage.py space run server once you run this one the server you can copy this go to brother you know it very well then paste it slash about us about us means there is a spelling mistake about us here you go you can see we are learning from django from kundan kumar so guys this was a, a purpose of this video in next video we will see how to create a dynamic you know dynamic url how to create your own html file and how to you know render that html file and many more how to send data so see you in next video guys keep learning keep asking questions using the comment box i will be happy to answer your questions if you have not yet subscribed my channels please do subscribe like shares and comments may god bless you